this is a huge project, but it's going to be awesome. You know what we should do? What's up everyone? Today we're starting a big project. This is going to take more than one video and probably a lot of time. This is a 1966 Cessna 310K. It suffered a nose gear failure which caused more damage than it's worth. We're going to part it out, sell all the parts except for the fuselage and flight controls and turn it into a flight sim. I hope to make it full motion but we'll see what happens. The first step of this project is going to be to take the rudder and the vertical fin off because my airplane is hanging in my T hanger and it won't fit in there because the rudder's too tall. It'll hit my airplane. So we've got to move it into a bigger hanger, take those parts off, and then we can move it over. First, I gotta brush all the snow off of this thing. Let's do it. It's a new day. When we wheeled the plane over here, we realized that the elevator won't fit between my shelves and the toolbox over there. It's just too stinking big. It was dark, it was cold, and we were trying to get it done before it got any colder. And in the meantime, my camera battery died, so I didn't get any of it on film. So, we're in here, here, it's ready to go. Let's get taking that engine off. the first video of our Cessna 310 teardown. In the next episode I hope to have both engines off and both wings off so that I can finally walk around in here. The plan is to use cheap 3D printers to integrate simulator hardware with the real hardware in the plane so it'll be just like you're flying the real thing. Be sure to check out the affiliate links down below if any of the tools that I used interest you. Be sure to like and subscribe and until next time you know what we should do.